Yo guys, in this video I'm gonna teach you how to convert all of your script into bytecode. Before we before we start, uh, I'm gonna explain a few things. Lua you bytecode is technically like instructions which tell Roblox what to do. This is also called a Lua bytecode. As you can see right over here, here's an example. You have all these hex type codes. For example, if you print in return as you can see these are the Lua functions right here. We got these OP codes right here, return, return, load true. We got this bytecode right here. But this is Lua bytecode executable. We can also make it 64 bit if you want. Not to see the Lua version, I'm using 5.4.1. Uh, you can also downgrade or upgrade. So this is the Lua C, but we're not worrying about this. So you're gonna download the uh, description, whatever that's in the description, go to the description, download this special code. I mean this app, download this app right here. Now what we're going to do is this is what we're going to do. We're going to type in this code. We're going to type in a special code. We're going to first type in function on Lua U. And then we do return. Just do this. That's all you have to do. Now make a few, like two spaces and do whatever script you want to do now. I'm going to type in, for example, print hello. So make sure you type this in here. Actually, I do not add the parentheses because I don't know it doesn't work sometimes. So then you wanna go here. I hate when this happens. I literally hate when this happens. You can see these are bytecode right here. These are bytecode instructions. Copy this. Go to decompiler, whatever. I'm gonna go to this website called Hex G String. This is not a Lua U compiler, but this tells you an idea. As you can see over here, we got somebody idea. As you can see, these are all unreadable symbols. But over here, we got on Lua U. Now, if we go here real quick, let's go to another tab. Go to another tab. Same thing, right? So you want to press this two times. You want to go here. And you want to go to string 2 hex. Oh my god, I hate that. You want to go here and paste it. You're going to find this code. You're probably going to find the same thing in here as well, see? Now that is the Lua U, so you can replace that. But we cannot replace it because you see all these users, zeros here? That's going to make the engine attach. So that's how Lua U works, guys. It's really easy. Uh, what you want to do with Lua U, what can you do with Lua U code? You can deserialize it. I have no deserializer at this time because it's really hard to make one. But you guys, I'm going uh, to subscribe, leave a comment, drop a like. That's how you make it. Link in the description.